April 1052, the second year of Zhu Yuan. Xi Xia is no more, as the late King Junlian and his successor defeated its queen and unified its previous territories under the Wu clan. With the Kingdom of Gan reigning as the sole Chinese power on the Silk Road, the wealth it generates finally funnels all to Qi Lian's vaults. However, King Zhu Yuan is still not content as rivals from the Indian subcontinent creep ever more closer through Tibet towards the Chilean mountain range and petty kings and tribes still squabble along the borders in the north and south, enticing the new ruler towards further subjugation. No matter what comes before them, the Wu clan will prove, as they have time and time again, that their ambitions cannot be halted by men or gods. Hello again YouTube, this is the Irritated Asian, back again with another CK3 roleplay series. This is for episode number 9. Yeah, episode 9. So, last time we left off, we completely expanded Gan by completely annexing the Xixia Kingdom. As you can see, the Duke of Zhenfan for some reason controls a huge portion. So, I mean, gotta get that opinion up, or somehow remove his authority. We'll see what comes first. And we have a little bit of territory here in central Tibet. Central, yeah, central. So we have a lot of options. Again, as I said from the end of last episode, we can go into Tibet. We can go into the end of the Middle East here. Or we can even go north of Mongolia. So, or even just take time to recuperate, get some troop numbers up, some gold, all that good stuff. So... We, there's a lot to look forward to in this episode. We'll see exactly what comes our way for our ruler, the great King Ju, Ju Yuan, right here. So without further ado, please remember to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoy this video as well as the content that I make. Leave any comments you have down in the description below. And ring the bell to get notified of future uploads and videos that just come up. And without further ado, let's get into episode 9. Now what we'll do now is really focus on getting ourselves set up here. Quite granular level 9, nice. And get some gold, our prestige, all of this stuff. We're gonna get all of that out. And I have to immediately spend gold now to get the sway progress, because I definitely want to get him good. Oh, what happened to my brother? He's not my bodyguard anymore? What happened? Oh my sister. My sister-in-law died in childbirth. So disappointing. No longer any of these things, why not? Why is he none of these things? Well, well, I, I guess. Well, I'll get the Duke of Erzu, Erzu because he's obviously good for some reason. Um, also gonna need a high almoner. My daughter, no, actually my Dutch Puto hit, my Dutch Puto hit will be good for that. And then, yeah, that's good for now. Get some gold up again. So we're gonna make you a steward. Because that's obviously the route you're going down. And hopefully you get intelligent. Ju Yuan. And after myself. My kingly self. Chi Lin is a siege by Blink Song. What? Oh, I forgot. We were in a war. Oh, wait. No, we weren't in a war. Were we? Oh, no. I think it was. I think it was Xi Xiao that was in a war. Oh. And then we probably took it over because they wouldn't give up. Well. No matter. Let's raise those men at arms. Oh, mental break? Oh, don't worry. I got going for a ride. Perfect. Athletic. That's always a good one to have. Alright, let's go after these guys because they wanted to come here. Yeah, yeah. Get the heck out. Alright, now we're going to quickly put an end to them by going down to their, to their capital here. Peasant uprising. Oh, is it pe for my peasants? Oh, who are you? How'd you have a weak hook on me? You're my steward? No, you're terrible. Compared to my compared to my duke, and now he's upset. Now he's upset. Great. I need a modifier contract. Okay, no, you don't have council rights guaranteed. So then how the heck did you get that? Whatever. I hate you. I hate you so much. Going to Chilin again, huh? And we'll come back. And we'll come back. Easier. Yes, another son. Great. See how he turns out. And I'll educate him too. Oh yeah, yeah. Now you're trying to run, huh? You're trying to run. You're trying to run out. You won't escape. 
There you go. Now, how much you can give me gold? Yes. Reparations. War reparations. Yes. Oh, yes. Tom, thank you for the gold. Deposit on the left. Deposit the gold on your left hand side. You know, I used to think in history class when I'd see maps of kingdoms that there'd be like ones that look weaker and stuff. I'm like, why wouldn't they invade them? Now I see because maybe they just couldn't. They didn't have the funds or the security. They had the men, manpower, but not the ability. And right now I feel that so hard. Like, look, look at that. I could wage a war, go for, you know, some territory here. My queen's territory, you know, and then give it to my son. And there's a lot of options, but the, the, the risk factor of going into debt, how long this war would last, I mean, I have to see how further it can go down, you know, that's, you just gotta play it smart, you gotta play it smart. Countess Yidu, converted culture, who, who is that, my steward, why can't I see that? Click to show, I'm clicking. I can't see that one. Did she turn from... I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. You do you. All the same. I still hate you. How is... My brother-in-law, my half-sister is arrested. My nephew, Rajkur Rajkur Mori, you unsure. She harbored Advaita. Advaita. Of the Wu Dynasty, yes. Yes, of the woos. Yes. Oh, how are you spending so much money, child? Let's sell it. Let's hopefully nothing bad happens. Even though they do not come with the thieves, the obligations of the towns you're offering are more generous than I could ever ask for. Oh, thank you, Countess E. Do. I know you're probably doing it just, you know, to be nice, but. Or to gain my favor, but thank you. Thanks for the gold. Haha, <laughs> now I can build further for the betterment of the kingdom. Hmm. Let's see. Belongs to me, right? Yep. Let's increase some of this. Actually, let's see. Can I do anything in Chiland? Oh, no. I want to do something more with gold. You know what? Let me upgrade the, the keep here. That's what's necessary here. Datong also needs to get some good stuff. Which I can't get because I don't have the gold for it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, and he died. Oh, there we go. They've broken apart. Perfect. Although he still has a huge portion. He's not happy at all. Can I move you out yet? No? How many more years? 1078? 20 more years? Jesus, you're gonna be dead before that, I'm sure. Well, very good. I mean, look at the look at those perks sometimes. I choose a, chose a great wife for him. Who won't hassle him of her about having a male lover. Journey troubles. Pushes me into horse water. How dare she! After giving me gold and everything, the disrespect. The disrespect. The doctor disrespect out here. I'm gonna kill her one day. I'm, I'm gonna kill her one day. Ooh. He's a lunatic, but he's pretty good. I'll you can use your advisor. Hmm. I visit my court when I want to. Why does everyone want to make me do stuff? They forget I'm a king. Absolute monarch here. Not not sharing. No Magna Carta shit. Alright. We ain't no King John. I think it was King John. I forget which king signed the Magna Carta, but it ain't gonna be me. You know, I just finished uh, re-watching a uh, isekai anime. A, uh, you know, where someone from the real world dies or gets teleported to a new world and this one uh how a realist hero you know um how a realist hero rebuilt the kingdom very i really like it because much like this game is about governance and expansion and honestly i feel like i'm the conquering type like if i was in the world and i became king all of a sudden i would definitely try to do stuff he did the main protagonist uh kazuya soma or makazuya how we like to pronounce um but yeah, I would definitely try to stabilize, but I would definitely be also militaristic and just conquer if I could. Weaker. I don't really know these people's personalities, but some of them aren't good, naturally. So I guess it's okay, but sometimes I can attack good people.
if you guys want to hear my thoughts about that anime in particular or even anime in general you can let me know in the comments i have a lot to talk about with those things and yeah but back to back to crusader kings these are the weakest i could easily do something against these people but i i just can't madoi maybe okay yeah i could attack madoi they have more gold but we have more troops and even in reserves you can just take them out there and allies are so far south oh my god we have stuff in india Jeez, i really gotta take a look at the grand map sometimes i guess i'll do this like try to declare war so i can see exactly how far my territory spreads like i have nothing in europe i know that i mean it'd be weird if i did somewhere like get involved in the in the fate of iberia here the iberian conflict mm -hmm. it's crazy but no it's crazy how i'm here in india like i i could slowly make my way east if it wasn't for guja if guja breaks up one day maybe but mm, see if we even still maintain that but Madoi could be conquered very easily. You know what? Ah, yeah, screw it. Why not? I need to do something other than wait for money. And I know I'm, I waste money this way, but whatever. Whatever. I'm confident. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, gotta raise all the army here then. I have to go. Yep. Must have been mercenaries or something. They have a lot of they have a lot of soldiers okay they're defending so we wait oh no we're too late hopefully we have an advantage oh we don't gregarious oh gosh oh gosh come on turn the tide turn the tide yes we're getting better yes we counter more i think no we don't but we're still better troop numbers oh no my wife was she my lover i don't remember but it's gonna be bad oh Oh, oh, yeah, I didn't like you. Okay, cool. I lose it. Thank you. Thank you, wife. I, for some reason, hated. Oh, my goodness. Tw a whole two years? Oh, jeez. Um, I'm in debt, too, which is not really good. These are the problems when you play in Asia. You just don't have the Pope to just ask to just like, ask for money, you know? And that's, the worst, that's honestly one of the worst of things. Two years later. Yes, easy. Perfect. All right, now disband. We are in debt. To Kunlun, just give me some gold. I I don't even care. Just give me some gold. Wow. Wow. For people who like the same genders, surprising how many children they're having. I like it. Respect. Respect. We'll call him CG. I like it. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. He look at him. He's a he's great in stewardship. So so great. So so great. Hmm. Your son-in-law declared dared to lead my son into carnal sin. I demand a slight. What cardinal sin? What did he do? What did what did what did he do? Oh. What? What? That doesn't make any sense. That that makes no sense. They're both heterosexual. How can they how can they be lovers? Were they just experimenting? I guess they were experimenting. Oh wow, he's 56. Ha, ah, good one, Chaff. There you go. You know. See, like, how? How? They both. I don't think they both like guys. But again, who knows? Things can be interesting. Things can change. Whatever. They be them. Life is life. Now we'll wait on you. you May whoever I guess. Almost there. Oh. Why is that always happen? Mid sentence. Died of old age at 72. A known murderer. I forgot about that. He will atone for his unspeakable crime in the next life. Ooh, devious and deceptive. Johnny Young's truth will, with truth itself may also be his undoing. Oh yes, my son here is is a schemer of sorts. All right, well, time to elect to council. Let's see. Some people don't like me, but that is that is fine. You know, his death came out of nowhere. Surprisingly. Very surprising. Yes, intelligent. Perfect. 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 Welcome, Nanam Nanamza. Welcome. 
married to my why does my son look so short here why are you just tall hmm Ooh, what's this beautiful reasons that your marriage is conspicuous in nature our marriage will not be torn apart by such obvious lies you witch I prove that it's fake. Of course it's fake. She's not related to me at all. Ridiculous. Oh no, I'm sick. How good are you? Do no more than what is necessary. You suck. I know you hate me, but come on. How am I doing in health wise? I'm fine. You know what? Actually, I kind of don't want to be this old. This old man. I want to be my young son, only 23. Yet to have a husband. Yet to have a wife. Oh, she's shrewd. Oh, she's good. A good one. I'm going to maybe crazy, but yeah, have to unequip all this stuff. I'll put some other stuff on here. Do that. Mm. And that's it. I guess. No, I can't equip that. But yeah, I'll equip those, and that's it. Hopefully I die. Oh yay yay! All of them. All of them are dying. What? That was my marshal, right? Yeah. Oh my god! It is a curse. This is a this is a curse. They keep dying every time they become a marshal. What is going on? Maybe you can die because I don't like you. Oh no! I forgot to disinherit. Whoops. Well. Look at that, she shot, suddenly built up. Yeah, no, we're not having that. We're not, we're not having that, no. You have one ally, the Duke of Thaton. No, I'm gonna reclaim my domains. I forgot to do that, because I forgot I had sons. This is what happens when you don't disinherit. Surrender now, prepare for your fight, fight, fight. After them. I'm almost gonna win too. I'm in massive debt though. See, this is what Charlemagne should never have allowed for his children to break him up and then suddenly fight over it because they'd be greedy as hell. Like, be honest. That's what happens when you leave children's powerful territories like this. They're gonna fight for it. What did they expect was gonna happen? Alright, there we go. All united. Again. But now we're in debt. Transfer vassals. Associate. Give me some territory and some monies, 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 monies. Well, that wasn't bad. A small civil war. And now we're good. And vassalize Duke Jifu of Ganan. Oh, I'm glad they. I'm glad they want to join me. I am glad. I'm surprised he suddenly wants to. How about you? No? Alright, that's fine. You don't need to. Well, a young king, 26. It's been a while since you had a young king. Very, very long time. Oh! Oh, yes! I could take the Vaj of some Gunpo. It's massive expansion. Massive. We'll wait for some gold and some reserves. I want to have 750 prestige before I do that. I do want to wage an offensive war, though. Allied with no one, so... Labas, Labas claim. Anyone else have a claim? Uh, some gunpo? No. Okay. My mother, Laba, will fight for her claim there. My mother's claim. Yeah, yeah, run, man. But you won't make it. <laughs> pensive. Yes, a pensive girl. Yes, child. Be smart. Matrilineal too. E so much gold. So much debt. So we're in and out of debt, but eh. Oh my boy's shed. Yes, super extended. Super extended indeed. HK you too. Hopefully they become shrewd. Whoever's shrewd, I will make my heir. Whoever is intelligent, I'll make my heir. Whoever is both, definitely heir. We'll see. In a month. Look at that. Rampant disease. Easy. There you go. Now your worries are over. Gone is expanded. Ha ha ha. Oh, so close. 
Congratulations, Queen Mother. And now I'm your primary heir too, so I will gain all of those territories. Look at that. Gone just keeps getting bigger and better. Harder, better, faster, stronger. Yes! My rival Shin! I don't know who you were, but... Whatever. I don't know why you were my rival. A nine-year-old. But... Die! <laughs> That's very bad to say. No child should be dying. I don't know why he died, but... I would have given him a proper funeral. Well, I think that will end this episode right here. We've lost another ruler. And because I forgot... I lost, I lost two rulers today. Uh, this episode. Um, unfortunately, for the second ruler, I did not see that both of the... Or all the sons were still in line for the throne. So, had a bit of a civil war. Not too bad, though. Very quick. Went to death. But, as you can see, we expanded even further. So, we got Song Gompo, the duchy here. Under the Queen Mother, which will fall to the heir. So, soon we'll be able to fill those domain limits here. Uh, we were able to bring in Gan An. Gan An here in the south. You know, from the Chu family. So, they were willing. And now we'll see what next episode holds. We'll have to definitely increase our our uh, funds here maybe continue trying to go for more of tibet or maybe even actually go north because zitsuyu as you can see complete another chaos we'll see hopefully we can get in there before genghis survives around 1200 around 1100 late 1100 so we got some time but we'll have to make it quick <clears throat> so yeah that is our current state at the moment but other than that thank you guys again so much for watching episode 9 here Make sure you like, share, and subscribe if you enjoy my content. And leave your comments down below. Let me know if you want to see a different character in this game, a different continent, maybe play a different game, or even, you know, review other different things. Like I said, I also have my thoughts on anime if you want to hear those. But with that, thanks again, guys. Have a great day and perhaps a great week, depending on when you're watching this. And this is the Irritated Asian who will catch you guys on the next one.